What is up guys? This is Garrett from Elevate Sniping, which is a YouTube channel I'm on. I don't know why for uh, these electronics, but eh, whatever. Um, so, a lot of people use otter boxes. Okay? Now here I have the commuter, and then I also have an unboxing I want to do next of the uh, Realtree Camo Defender. But, here's the unboxing of this. I mean, it has this rugged thing it's supposed to be protective rugged case um has two layers of protection and includes screen protector so pop this open try and slide this out with one hand i don't know how well this is going to work um but i've actually had this uh case on my phone for a day and a half two days now and the power button Hitting the power button is so freaking hard. I put so much force into it. And I don't like it. So I just took it off. I'm going to try the Defender see what happens. If that doesn't work out, I'll either use my Snap-on case or my Ballistic case because, yeah. So what's in this thing? You got what the uh, case was sitting in. You get a screen protector with a cloth and a squeegee to get bubbles out or water if you use the water method. Which I don't because it's kind of scary. Not or to put water on your phone. Then you have an otter box booklet and like what you got and that it's a good case, etc. Um so I do have the all black otter box commuter case. Um it has a soft it's actually kind of hard rougher uh, material which is better than the 4S. The 4S was flimsy crappy stuff so anytime you try to put it on it stretch it and just make it look bad. So this it's rougher interior 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 yep I can't talk sorry and then you have a hard plastic outside and they have the cutouts you can see the Apple which I love a nice cutout camera for your camera you have the power button which is actually covered up like I said and it's extremely hard to hit I hate it um the volume keys are covered the mute switch is not it's left open as you can see there and then the bottom you actually have covers for your charger and your headphones. Now the charger one, once you start using it a lot, it's going to get weaker and kind of not want to clip in all the way. So my solution for that is take off the case of your phone and pinch it down for like a minute or so. And it's going to get back that boingy springiness back to it and want to pop back up and lock in and stay. So to put this together, you just slide this in your phone. Your phone just slips in very easy. Then getting this case on... I find it easier to start at the bottom. Again, I can't show you because I use my iPhone to record. And then work your way around, snap everything in, make sure your out uh, your ports are out and good. Make sure your power button's in there. And your volume keys and stuff are on the right side for your phone, which is actually the left side of your phone, but I'm saying it's on the right side so it works. Yeah, anyway, and then you have your mute. A uh, vibrate switch power thing, whatever, and then you have the cutout, which I like. I would give this case a eh, four out of five because it actually gets kind of slick. If I'm working or something and I'm sweating, my phone tends to slip because of this material. It's not like grippy, except like right here and right here, which doesn't really help because I hold my phone like this when I'm using it, so I'm not even touching the rubber at all. So that was the all black otterbox commuter series case rate comment subscribe guys peace